Hey Jeff, Dave here at Online Motorsports. I got this thing off the rack here, but I'm going to do a little walk around around the exterior of the vehicle, then I'll uh, go through the engine compartment and we'll finish up in the interior action. Well, as far as paint on it, like I said, it's at least an eight, eight and a half. Um, if we go around, I'll, I'll, I'll point out any imperfections that I can see here that the camera may not pick up. Get a little bit of a nick there. It could be it's actually been touched up, uh, but that's typical. I know the paint, like I said, is at least five, six years old, minimally, maybe older. But it is a uh, two-stage paint, so it's it's not a single-stage uh, paint. Which, if it was, it wouldn't look anywhere near as good as this. Um, there's that chin spoiler you hate, but any I think it finishes it off the car. Uh, wheel wise, you can see there's one little rub mark there, a little one there. The other wheels may have, but well, actually, this rear right is just perfect. No curb rash. Wheels have good shine to them, which a lot of these, when they get, when they lose their shine, you can have them sent out, but it's almost cheaper to buy new, new wheels or, or a new set of reconditioned wheels and have them swapped out. As far as like all the, the rear uh, bumpers, there's no marks in any of the, the bumper posts, so nobody's backed this thing into a garage too far and so on. Um, well, it's still got the, uh, the Corvette there. Most of them have lost these over the years. It does have a rear defroster, power antenna, which does work. Now let's check out this driver's side right rear wheel. That's in very good shape, no curb rash. Check the front. Just a little bit of minor. I don't know if you can pick it up in that picture right there. Now these wheels can be reconditioned without without getting crazy and, and sending them off to California uh, if you're not crazy about those edges. And it's actually not that much money. It's got good rockers on it. For some reason these guys never I don't know if these are the original rockers, but a lot of these rockers take a beating over the years. Like I say, as far as up front, small, small little, I don't know if I want to call that a spider, it's just sort of an imperfection in the paint. Nobody's nosed it out like they do from time to time. It was just a piece of dust, but paint-wise, you're in pretty good shape on paint. The car really doesn't need paint, period. Um, it's got the dark glass tops on, there are, you know, no... Uh, no cracks, none of that crazy nonsense. Um, let me do this. I'm going to stop this video and start under the hood on the next one, Jeff.